This is a review of the KJV Large Print Thinline Bible from Thomas Nelson. The Thomas Nelson KJV Large Print Thinline Bible, featuring the timeless beauty of the trustworthy King James translation, strikes the perfect balance between portability and readability. This lightweight, convenient, and easy to read Bible is ideal for everyday use. The large print text, featuring the new Thomas Nelson Comfort Print KJV font, will enhance your reading experience and the features of this easy to carry Bible will enrich your understanding of God's word. As we get a closer look at this KJV large print thin line Bible from Nelson, we're seeing two of the three available color options here. This is gonna be the black on the left and the burgundy option on the right. There's also a navy and black combined option that's not pictured here, but is also available on our website. And we're gonna see that the features of these Bibles include the exclusive KJV Comfort Print, which is the beautiful new Thomas Nelson KJV font designed in Denmark. In this version being large print, also features the easy to read large print 10 point type in that comfort print. Very nice, easy to read as we'll see. Also includes the words of Christ in red, a presentation page, translator's preface to King James, gilded page edges, two ribbon markers, topical subheadings, a one year Bible reading plan, 30 days with Jesus section, full color maps, and lifetime guarantee from Thomas Nelson. Now we'll take a look at the construction and binding of these KJV large print thin line Bibles from Nelson. This is what's called the leather soft edition. Again, that comes in black burgundy and a black navy combo version not pictured here. And we're gonna see here that this is a lot nicer than your typical imitation leather or synthetic cover. Um, it certainly is soft, true to its name. And we probably liken it to the quality of a bonded leather, something along those lines, but it's certainly pretty flexible. Uh, we're gonna see here that it can roll up a little bit there. It certainly has a, a nice edge to it there. Of course, there's also this really decorative hand stitching that goes around the outside of that leather cover. And of course, this one again is the black edition. You're seeing there the two ribbon markers and the gold gilded page edges. And of course, Holy Bible's in gold on the front. There's Holy Bible on the spine in gold and KJV and the Thomas Nelson logo on the black. On the back, you're typically gonna see the ISBN and style number there. So that's of course the black edition. Um, the burgundy here, once again, just kind of seeing it can open up, it's pretty flexible. You can certainly flex it in there. And this is a, it's a, definitely a dark shade of burgundy. Um, I, I wouldn't call it a, a brown tint, but it's, it's not the darkest burgundy I've seen, but it's certainly attractive. Still, of course, has the gold Holy Bible, gold gilded page edges. You're getting two burgundy ribbon markers on this edition, of course, and there's the spine on that one. Uh, but you're seeing here, these really are nice Bibles for the price. And what you're gonna see also is the dimensions of these Bibles. And of course, them being thin line, that's kind of what makes them unique. So we're gonna see here on the size that the width and across here is six and a half inches wide. The height is gonna be nine and three fourths inches tall. So almost 10, not quite 10, but then the thickness is only about one inch thick. Hard to get a really nice readable font, a size 10 font, especially in the comfort print that's that thin. That's not a really bulky Bible and not too heavy of a Bible, even with this being large print. So we're gonna see this as a really good option. Uh, it's econom economical at the one at a time price. And we even have a good case price on these Bibles available in all three color options. Here's a better look at the black edition of this KJV large print thin line Bible from Thomas Nelson. And we're going to see, of course, uh, again, that cover, the flexibility there. Uh, but we're also going to see this slip case that it comes with. Uh, it's like a little dust jacket, basically, or, or slip cover, you could call it. Thomas Nelson King James Version KJV large print thin line Bible. Easy to read 10 point type. Words of Christ in red full color maps and double ribbon markers. And again, it's the leather soft is the, the style of that binding and that cover. And we're gonna see some of the features that it's included that we've already gone over there. As an example of the actual text size and of course the words of Christ in red, you're seeing that Thomas Nelson guarantee, they're guaranteed for life. That's a great deal on these economically priced large print Bibles. And then some of the features there, of course, as we saw, and again, uh, the black one, certainly a nice uh, leather soft cover with a, a really good feel to it. 
uh, certainly a nice, uh, a nice thickness and it's a, a substantial cover there. Uh, still flexible, looks nice, um, but still at a good price. And this is the burgundy edition of the KJV large print thin line Bible from Nelson. And we're seeing again here that shade of burgundy, uh, very nice and flexible cover, uh, nice burgundy inside lining there. And of course the slip cover and dust jacket here for this one as well. Uh, it also shows the burgundy on the front, burgundy leather soft, of course, uh, just gives you an idea there. Um, again, really just, it's thin, only one inch thick here on this, including the large print and certainly a nice shade of burgundy, uh, nice attractive Bible there. And a final shot here of our color options on the KJV large print thin line Bible, the black, the burgundy, their various slip covers, and of course there's the black and navy version that is not pictured. The first thing we'd like to show on the inside of the KJV large print thin line Bible from Nelson is gonna be this note regarding the type. Again, that first feature listed is that exclusive KJV comfort print, which is the beautiful new Thomas Nelson KJV font by 2K Denmark. And we can read here and says that this Bible was set in the Thomas Nelson KJV font, also known as comfort print, a typeface commissioned by Thomas Nelson publishers and designed in our house by Klaus Krog and Heidi Rand Sorensen of 2K Denmark. The design takes inspiration from a distinctive typeface found in an early Thomas Nelson Novum Testamentum, that's New Testament, printed in 1844 in Edinburgh, that's Scotland, a type which in turn reflects several Scotch Roman typefaces created by the celebrated English punch cutter Richard Austin for the type foundry of William Miller near 1808 and 1813. And the designers of the Thomas Nelson KJV font sought to reflect Thomas Nelson's rich 200 year tradition of stewarding the KJV while also embodying the best advancements in modern Bible typography. The result is a distinctive new Bible typeface that is uncompromisingly beautiful, bold, and readable at any size and perfectly suited to the King James Version. And the font you're already seeing that this note regarding the type is the comfort print. It's a unique font. It's a little bit of a combination of old and new. That T, the way that kind of that dog ears on that T is really pretty unique. It's kind of got an antiquity to it, but you're also gonna see that it's really clear and readable, especially in this size 10 font of this large print thin line Bible from Nelson. Now we'll take a look at some examples of that text. The first thing we see on the inside of this large print thin line Bible is gonna be this presentation page. So this is nice for gift giving, or even if you get it yourself, you can write your name in the front cover, has uh, the entirety of Psalm 119, 105 at the bottom of that presentation page. Then we get to the title page, the Holy Bible containing the Old and New Testaments, an authorized King James Version red letter edition. Then we get to the Epistle Dedicatory, also known as the Translator's Preface to King James. And we're not gonna read that there, but that's two pages. Uh, of course, the Epistle Dedicatory was the, the note of the Translator's to King James. And that's pretty unique. Again, uh, it is present in basically all of these KJV comfort print Bibles from Thomas Nelson. Um, but that's nice to see in an economically priced Bible. Uh, makes it a little bit more special there. And it's nice to see those in the front of the King James Bible. After the presentation page, epistle dedicatory, and the content section, we then of course get to the first book of Moses called Genesis. And you're seeing here the wide angle shot of this comfort print. That's a size 10 font. It's pretty large. We're all the way zoomed out. There's no zoom on this shot at all. It's a very wide angle shot. And you're still seeing pretty clear print on the page. You're already seeing the beginning of these topical subheadings on the Bible, which is going to be, of course, the one at the top is the creation for verses one and two. You see the divisions there of the first day, second day, third day, fourth day, and fifth day. And again, even the wide shot, very clear and easy to read. And we're getting a little bit closer look here of Genesis one. Then we specifically see there the creation. Number one, in the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. And verse two, and the earth was without form and void and darkness was upon the face of the deep and the spirit of God moved upon the face of the waters. As we always like to check that, that S in spirit is capitalized right off the bat, second verse of the Bible, first good test showing that this KJV large print thin line Bible has an excellent KJV text. That would be a Cambridge KJV text. More shots of the comfort print font and more examples of these topical subheadings. We're seeing the sixth day of creation, the creation of man. 
We're seeing the giving of food. The seventh day, the Garden of Eden, man to care for the garden, Adam names living creatures, the creation of woman, the first marriage, the temptation, the fall of man, and the curse. As we get to the New Testament, we start to see excellent examples of the words of Christ in red in this KJV large print thin line Bible. And we're here in Matthew specifically, chapters number five and six. And this, of course, is the beginning of the Sermon on the Mount. Uh, and it's also, you're still seeing those topical subheadings, which this one starts with the Beatitudes, and then teachings on murder and anger, uh, teachings on divorce, teachings on oaths, and teachings on giving. Then we get into John chapter 1, and we're seeing a little bit more contrast here, not as much red on the page. We'll look down here at specifically chapter 1 and verse 43. And here in John chapter 1, verse 43, we're seeing that topical subheading, the calling of Philip and Nathanael. In verse 43, the day following, Jesus would go forth into Galilee and findeth Philip and saith unto him, follow me. Basically a nice two word sermon there and it's in and of itself. Very clearly, of course, Christ is speaking and that's going to be indicated there when you see uh, that red text, the words of Christ in red, you know Christ is speaking. As another text example, we're going to get here to the end of 2 Timothy in chapter number 3. We always like to show these verses, 2 Timothy chapter 3, verses 16 and 17. All scripture is given by inspiration of God and is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, throughly furnished unto all good works, T-H-R-O-U-G-H-L-Y, throughly, not thoroughly, Another excellent example of this KJV text. We're also looking at 1 John chapter 5 and specifically verses 7 and 8. 1 John 5, 7 and 8 says, For there are three that bear record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. And there are three that bear witness in earth, the Spirit and the water and the blood, and these three agree in one. And we believe that capital S in Spirit absolutely should be capitalized. That's another excellent example of this KJV text being a trustworthy Cambridge KJV text. As we get to the back of the Bible here, we come to Revelation chapter 22, and then we start to get into the back of the Bible features. The KJV large print thin line Bible from Nelson features a one-year Bible reading plan. So we see that the one-year reading plan, as the name implies, helps you to read your Bible through in a year. It does this by giving you daily reading sections, and it actually breaks it up into a morning section and an evening section. So the columns here, this is on January 1st, it says you should read Matthew, M-A-T-T, -T, Matthew, chapter 1. Then the evening you should read Genesis, and that's going to be chapters 1, 2, and 3. If we were to skip over here to March, uh, March 1st, we're seeing you would read in the morning Mark chapter 7, verses 14 through 37, and the evening portion would be Numbers 23, 24, and 25. Then there's a section called 30 Days with Jesus. It's a little bit similar to what you might see like in a harmony of gospels or miracles and parables of our Lord. It just gives you a 30 day reading schedule where you basically can read on, on the first day, John chapter one, verses one through 51, all the way down to the 30th day, Luke 24, one through 53. Good way to follow along and see what does Jesus have to say? What was, what was his gospel message? Uh, what were his sermons and what was his life about? Pretty neat little section there. And the final back of the Bible feature are going to be these eight pages of full color maps. It starts with the world of the patriarchs, Exodus and the conquest of Canaan, the land of the 12 tribes, kingdom of David and Solomon, and Jesus' ministry. There's a two-page spread covering Paul's missionary journeys. Pretty unique map there. Finally, Jerusalem in the time of Jesus. So there you have it, KJV large print thin line Bible from Thomas Nelson, available of course in the leather soft editions, the black, the burgundy, also the navy and black two-tone edition that is not pictured here. Don't forget to personalize it. Of course, we offer the name imprinting on the front cover of these Bibles. We do it at the bottom right of that front cover. We would do it in gold to match the page edges, of course, on these black and burgundy editions. Again, really cool Bible, exclusive KJV comfort print, beautiful new Thomas Nelson KJV font. 
It's an easy to read, large print 10 point type, but still in a very manageable size and not too thick of a Bible, only one inch thick. So you're getting uh, not too thick of a Bible, nice carrying size and still fairly lightweight for that larger print. You're seeing the words of Christ in red, comes with the presentation page, translator's preface to King James, gilded page edges, two ribbon markers, topical subheadings, one year Bible reading plan, 30 days with Jesus, eight pages of full color maps at the back of the Bible, and a lifetime guarantee from Thomas Nelson. Really great one at a time purchase if you want a economically priced a large print Bible with really readable font. Again, we hope you enjoyed this review of the KJV large print thin line Bible from Thomas Nelson from the number one source for all things KJV. Thank you for watching and we look forward to sending you one soon.